Ashley. She's a vendor and a pinup. She's a hell of a gal. Why don't you guys give it up for Patty Pearl? Yeah! That's my little call, baby. Okay, so we're gonna start the question. I'm gonna let Lauren take over. Oh, uh, here we go. <laughs> you want me to give her a hard question? Hmm. Okay, so it's kind of we're gonna ask. I don't want to ask. Just like, what kind of card do you like? What kind of music do you like? So, want to make it work for it. Okay, so you took it a step farther, as opposed to just having the hair and having the style. You actually vend, and you actually me, decided to use that as a way to make a living. So, best cross ever. <laughs> what about it? What about rockabilly? And what about the whole, the music, the scene, the people? Made you decide that you wanted to actually vend, and you wanted to actually have that as your business. What inspires that? What revs your engine? This cat. <laughs> Happy Pearls, I hope you guys are all having fun today. Um, so I grew up in San Diego, California, and my mom and my grandma owned an antique store on the Mesa Boulevard. I don't know if you guys know where that is, but it's a big deal out there. And so I grew up around things of the past, and I've always loved things of the past. Um, so I enjoy seeing everybody get dressed up. I like the sense of class. A lot of people nowadays tend to be pretty plain, so I enjoy seeing everybody taking the extra time to make themselves look nice, so I liked getting involved with that. Awesome. So it's, it's more than just that, it's about also making women feel good about themselves and making people have fun and embrace it. Oh, very awesome. Thank you so much. Give it up for Patty Pearls, guys. Woo! Line up up to the side. Catalina Bay. Who's our next lovely pinup, Catalina? Oh, that's a f oh, that's kind of sneaky and dirty. I like that too. Lottie, is it Bedlam? Is it Bedlam? Oh, I like Bedlam better. Is it terrible? It's scandalous. Okay, Lottie Bedlam, everybody. So, Lottie. Your outfit is fantastic. Thank you. What inspired that today? Because I mean, you're doing velvet, and I see you have petticoats and the aquamarine with the gloves. So that's some dedication. And what's the the face, the neck tattoo? Uh, oh, what inspired that that actual tattoo? Because in rockabilly, there's a lot of tattoos. There's the cars. There's the music. So tell us a little bit about all of that. All of you. All of me. Introduce Lottie. Oh, so tall. I know it is. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I'm gonna take the shoes off. Well, hello, I'm Lottie Bedlam. And um, honestly, the inspiration for most of my tattoos is, <laughs> uh, is just uh, my love for music, my love for art, my love for everything. My chest piece was inspired by band Five Figure Death Punch. I don't know if anybody likes that. I'm a huge fan, and it's from their song that made or break them, uh, The Bleeding. So.